Good day everyone. Again, I am Angela Alto. I'm here to uh, give a presentation about critical thinking. Goal thinking. So the subject is philosophy. And let's talk about what is critical thinking. According to uh, Wikipedia, critical thinking is the analysis of facts to form a judgment. The subject is complex and several different definitions exist, which generally include the rational, skeptical, unbiased analysis or evaluation of factual evidence. So, it's simply just a problem, then we have to think, then we get a solution. Critical thinking is, starts with the questions who, what, how, where, and why. There are three core skills of critical thinking. Number one is curiosity. It is a desire to learn more information and seek evidence as well as being open to uh, new ideas. The next one is skepticism. Having a healthy questioning attitude about new information that you are exposed to. Skepticism is a line or uh, a word that it has no fear for either the questions or hope or beliefs. Um, if we talk about skepticism, the other side of skepticism is Zionism, which is afraid to believe. Then the other half is a blind faith or afraid questions the third one is humility admit that your opinions and ideas are wrong when faced with new convincing evidence that states otherwise also have benefits of critical thinking critical thinking enables you to see beyond not judgment cultural norms and learn how to understand other factors that can influence decision making this empathy and understanding is crucial to effective teamwork and leadership. The skills that we must have to obtain critical thinking. First is observation. Next, analysis. Next one, interpretation. Then, reflection. Also, the evaluation, inference, explanation, problem solving, and lastly, decision making. Specifically, we need to be able to think about a topic or issue in an objective and critical way. In critical thinking, you can stand even in a complex situation. It also builds up your confidence to have a great and strong decision. Do you want to develop your critical thinking skills? These are the few other techniques to encourage critical thinking are. First, use analogies. Second, promote interaction among students. Number three, ask open-ended questions. Number four, allow reflection time. Number five, use real-life problems. And lastly, number six, allow for thinking prompts. That's it. Thanks for watching my video. I hope you like this and you learn about my topic. God bless.